Hi, everybody. Welcome to My Child, My Voice. We are going to have a new segment called The Kid Connection. Today, we are going to read a story and make a fun snack. So if you have a kiddo around, go grab them and join in the fun. We're going to read a bear, uh, book about um, Baby Bear, Baby Bear, What Do You See by Bill Mira. Uh, oh, what is it? Martin, not Miller, Bill Martin and Eric Carl. Baby bear, baby bear, what do you see? I see a red fox sleeping by me. Oh, slipping by me. Red fox, red fox, what do you see? I see a flying squirrel gliding by me. <clears throat> flying squirrel, flying squirrel, what do you see? I see a mountain goat climbing near me. Mountain goat, mountain goat, what do you see? I see a blue heron flying by me. Blue heron, blue heron, what do you see? I see a prairie dog digging by me. Prairie dog, prairie dog, what do you see? I see a striped skunk strutting by me. Striped skunk, striped skunk, what do you see? I see a mule deer running by me. Mule deer, mule deer, what do you see? I see a rattlesnake sliding by me. Rattlesnake, rattlesnake, what do you see? I see a screeching owl hooting by me. Screech owl, screech owl, what do you see? I see a mama bear looking woo, at me. Baby bear, baby, oop, no, not baby bear, this is the mama. Mama bear, mama bear, what do you see? I see, ooh, what does she see? A red fox, a flying squirrel, a prairie dog, a striped skunk, a mountain goat, a blue heron, a mule deer, a rattlesnake, a screech owl, and my baby bear looking at me. That's what I see. I've always loved all of the books by Eric Carle. I love their artwork and how they're all about animals. Super cool. So I'm going to move my camera down so you guys can see my tabletop and make a yummy snack with me. All right, there's our little bear. Our bear, you could use toast, so you could toast your bread or you could just make it like a peanut butter sandwich. If you don't like peanut butter or have an allergy, you could use fluff almond butter, sun butter, all sorts of fun things. Today I am going to use uh, some regular white bread and peanut butter. I like to use the smooth peanut butter. Uh, when it has chunks in it, it kind of uh, has a harder time uh, for kids to be able to put it onto the bread. And as you can see, we've been eating a lot of peanut butter at my house. We're getting down to the bottom of my jar. So you're gonna spread your peanut butter out. This is kind of tricky for the kids to do, but it is a good fine motor skill to learn. It will help them with their writing and all sorts of other things. This is a great after school snack, or if you're doing distance learning right now, a good, even a lunch, just something different instead of the normal peanut butter sandwich. Just something kind of fun. So you've got 
it all spread out so you have his brown little face on your bread. The next thing you're gonna do is get a banana. So I've already cut a little bit, so I'm gonna peel it. And most kids can use a butter knife pretty well. I would not use like a steak knife or anything like that. A butter knife will work perfectly well for your uh, cutting of your banana. So you're gonna cut three pieces off. One, two, three. Three pieces of banana. So now you have three circles. The first circle you're gonna do is your little bear nose. So he can smell all the honey that the bees are making. And then he needs to be able to hear his friends. And there's his ears. The next thing you're gonna know, need is, I guess that's more of like his muzzle or his mouth. There's his little nose and his eyes to see. There we go, boop. And now you have a yummy after school snack to go with our storybook by Eric Carl and Bill Martin. Baby bear, baby bear, what do you see? Hopefully that doesn't make you get dizzy, guys. Thank you guys for joining us today with Kid Connection. Thank you, MPU, for producing the show and helping us out. We hope you have a blessed day. Everybody stay healthy. Thanks, guys. See you next time. All right. That was great.